Japanese commercials. Easiest money you'll ever make. <laughs> Grand Larson is right up there. You ready for this? No worries. I do my own stunts. Hey, you're just a ride along, man. So don't get all Hong Kong style in there. I am a method actor. If I'm gonna play a saint with any degree of emotional truth, I gotta make it real. Trust me, Burke, it'll be real. You're robbing a bank dressed like yourselves. Hell yeah. Who doesn't want to be Johnny Gat? Ultra postmodernism. I love it. I'm cool with the Saints movie, but do we really gotta drag this asshole actor around? Cut Josh some slack. He's just researching his part. Yeah, I hope he signed a waiver. All right, people. Nobody moves! Nobody dies! Burke! Sorry, jumped his line. Can we, uh, can we go again? You all know the drill. Can I get a picture with the boss? Say sleaze. Get in line, bitch. Hey, don't be a dick. Did you call yourself gangbangers? You're a bunch of pussies. We should be all up in their shit like... Fuck! Oh, that's different. You got a plan or we just shooting all these motherfuckers? That is my plan. Works for me. fucking shotguns. Yeah, normally banks don't look like a palace either. You see those statues before you blew them up? Will you forget the horses? These guards are packing military-grade hardware. Who the hell are we robbing? Plan B? Yep. Josh, get over here. Got the tools right here, Holmes. So, uh, what's plan B? Huh? Drill it? <laughs> Fuck no. We blow it. What? D not cool, man! Time to get to work. We'll need to set those above the vault. Hey, I think we've got company. Looks like they're coming in from the lobby. Ah, I love this part. Shondi. What? We need to talk. We really don't. It's just, if I die here, I don't want things to go sad. I should be so lucky. Let's get him! Ha! I haven't had this 
much fun in years! <laughs> Hey, Josh Burke. Don't be starstruck. Very approachable. You want me to uh, sign your breasts? Uh, no. That's all right. Yeah, you know, by night play on DVD. Let's get the chopper and lift this baby out of here. Hey, guys, you can call up the helicopter. Found the way to open the vault. Don't touch it! Josh! Are you trying to get us all jail time? What? I don't want to be some dude's bitch. Do I have to go after him? Forget about it. He'll be fine. How long until the chopper gets here? I don't know. Probably like two waves of SWAT guys. Sounds about right. Here they come!
What is this? We paid up this month. Someone paid more. What happened? We got arrested. No, to us. Burke's right. We traded our dicks in for pussies. Seriously. Movie deals, commercials. Saint's name used to mean something more than body spray and some ass-tasting energy drink. Our brand's worth a shitload of money. Is that what it's all about? It's always about the money, Mr. Gat. Which is precisely why our employer wishes to speak with you. If you'll indulge us. You have any idea who you're fucking with here? Of course. A remarkable likeness. These visions are Viola and Kiki, and I am Philippe Laurent, chairman of a multinational organization called The Syndicate. Never heard of it. Evidently not, or you would not have robbed our bank. Perhaps you wonder why you are still breathing at this point. Actually, I wonder why my foot's not up your ass at this point. <laughs> like it or not, Mr. Gatt, our organization is expanding into still water. I am offering you the chance to leverage your assets against your lives. Ladies? You may continue to operate the Saints Old Tour Media Group as you see fit, in exchange for 66% of your monthly gross revenue. That is before taxes, of course. Listen, you French fuck. Please. I am Belgium. So make yourself a fucking waffle. We done here. And I had so hoped to come to a rational business arrangement. Stillwater. Johnny, you can't even drive stick. How are you gonna fly a plane? 
Details, details. Just cover the boss. Go. I got this. Guy can take care of himself. We gotta deal with these guys. Attention, passengers. This is your new captain speaking. Our updated flight plan has us landed in Stillwater. I'd like to remind all passengers to remain seated and enjoy the flight. Great. Who gave God a mic? It's Easter Open! Oh, I can see some of our passengers are getting restless. Here's some relaxing music for your enjoyment. <laughs> Your captain is having troubles finding the clutch. Let's fly away on vacation holiday with you. I'm dreaming of a tropical location, a paradise for two. Yo, I'm opening the cargo bay doors. Find some sheets and jump out the back. It should be clear. All right, motherfuckers. The door is open.
Are you kidding me? I never let my girl... Wait, what is that? What is what? That plane is... Okay, don't freak out or anything. But I think that plane is gonna try to ram us. What do you mean, don't freak out? Do you have a plan? Yeah. I shoot out the window, land in the plane, kill Philippe, then jump out the back again. You mean we, right? Look, just remember how happy you were when I caught you. Wait, what? Ah, shoot the window and land in the plane. What the fuck was I thinking? I deserve that. Gentlemen, negotiations were less than successful. Viola and Kiki will spread the word. Steelport belongs to the Syndicate, and the Saints are not welcome. Mr. Kilbane, gather your luchadores and bring me their leader's head. Mr. Miller, hack into the Saints' accounts and leave them nothing. The body of Mr. Gat will be a message for all who oppose the Syndicate. There is no mercy, only death. Don't mourn your friend. You'll be joining him soon. Loren's gonna pay for this. We'll need a car. Sean, do you got any idea where we are? Steelport. It's kinda like Bangkok's abusive father. Been here before? Spring break. Great. What the fuck does feel boss mean? You don't wanna know. Okay, whatever. You know where we're going? Look, I was really high the last time I was here. Just drive, it'll come back to me. So, about getting a gun. Why don't you just look up friendly fire on your phone? What? It has GPS, right? Check your map. We should let Pierce know what's up. I texted him. He's bringing the crew. Looks like we'll need more guns. Any ideas? Yeah, we raid the guard armory. They have one of those here? 
Right on. You can't be serious. We need guns, they have guns. I don't see the problem. Getting shot comes to mind. Blah, blah, bullets, blah, blah, blah. I just flew through a fucking plane. Also a shitty idea. Whoa, Pierce, where'd you come from? I thought I was talking to Shandy. Not cool. Because, I mean, Pierce, well, I mean, that guy bitches about everything and... All right, all right. We'll pick a fight with the military. Good times. Anyone from the spring break days still live around here? Yeah, I keep up with one of my exes. Is place big enough for the crew? I already offered it to Pierce and the boys. Eh, it doesn't really answer the question. I know. My car now! The celebrity of the Third Street Saints was put to a violent and destructive test in Stillwater. Patrons of a local bank were subjected to a mock holdup by this internationally popular gang. However, excitement was replaced with panic when shots rang out and blood began to decorate the lobby. During the ensuing firefight, the bank's vault was ripped from the building, showering rubble down onto the bystanders below. The extent of the damage landed the Saints, like so many celebrities before them. Wow, that still exists? What? That's where I used to score this weed. This is Jane Valderrama with your Celebrity Crime News. This week on Nightblade. Nightblade comes to grips with the loss of his true love and vows to get justice. Damn it, Nightblade, she's dead. They never found the body. Has the death of his wife pushed Nightblade over the edge? It's crazy, man. If you go into Mr. X's club, you're a dead man. Stu, I already am one. Nightblade! Sylvia! <laughs> Josh Berg stars as Nightblade. That's where I had my first. Um, on second thought, that one's kind of personal. Here's the cash I have on me. Where's this armory? Not far, it's on the GPS. Time's wasting. What makes you Damn. think you can get a... Like some hellish children's book, the sky has fallen in Steelport. Ten people are dead after several cars came raining out of the sky, crushing an apartment building in a fire of blaze. 
dozens of bodies, along with a number of crates and mangled vehicles, filled the streets nearby. Looters raided the scene before the police arrived, salvaging car stereos and sex dolls from the debris. The city morgue has not released the names of the victims killed in what seems to be a mid-air accident, and no plane wreckage has been found. This is Jane Valerama with your Steve Moore Disaster Report. This week on Nightblade, reeling from the loss of his wife, Nightblade. should all be in that warehouse. Great. How are we moving everything? Maybe you should have thought about that before attacking an armory. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Seriously, how are we gonna do it? Don't worry, Pierce has that covered. Hey, uh, Tom? Tom, can we get some food in here? I'm starving, man. I know you're not a lady. I'm just asking a question. In. Shooting them probably doesn't help change their mind. Are we just Look at the size of that thing. Bet that's a hell of a way to end a gunfight. Good idea. We'll take it with and find out. Yeah, right. Wait. You're serious, aren't you? Cover me, boys!
Here's the weapons cache, and these look like UAV drone controls over here. Looks like UAV drone controls. Who the fuck says that? Okay, is this really the time? Hey, just saying. Shooting! Oh, 
So what's next? What's next is you go back to Stillwater. What? No, this is my fight too. Girl, you don't get messy. Let us take care of business. Fuck you. I'm doing this for Johnny. All right. Well, if we're going to bring in the boys, 
We're gonna need a new place. You're worried about real estate? We have guns. Let's use them. Relax, Shandi. We got it all covered. rain can refresh the soul and wash away the stains of the day. When that rain is several tons of metal, the stains are all that's left of the people caught in the downpour. Several National Guard helicopters suffered from some form of malfunction during what officials are saying was a training exercise. Though several eyewitnesses report one helicopter carrying what looked like a bomb, no confirmation is being given. The wreckage is being cleared away and taken for further analysis in the hopes such an event will never happen again. This is Jane Valderrama with your Steelport Breaking News. This week on Nightblade, Nightblade confronts Marion, whose love for him is growing stronger and more dangerous. I thought this was an emergency. You said you needed me. I do. Uh, I don't have time for this. Nightblade! How's the crew settling in? Man, we gotta get a new place. That's the...
studio shit ain't working at all. Oh, spend too much time in posh hotels? <laughs> I can't help it that the rest of the world treats the saints right. Doesn't mean we should get soft. I hear you. Listen, how about you and me roll around the city and see what Steelport has to offer? You convince me. Just meet me at the park. I'll pick you up. This car could use a little tuning. Let's find the rim jobs and get it cleaned up. Shawnee's taking this thing with Gap pretty hard. And we all are. I know, but you're always pissed off. Our girl's not as crazy as you. Don't worry, keep an eye on her. were you rolling with Gat anyway? Long time. He was there when I first joined the Saints. Shit. What was he like back then? He mellowed with age. Until Aisha died. And he was fucking pissed.
Cars got some more style. Now it's our turn. Head to Planet Saints. I don't know, man. That's like wearing the band's T-shirt to the concert. Nothing wrong with wanting to look good. I always look good. We need some driving music. See if you can find something good. That was Alda Nova singing about cocaine. Those girls in tight dresses. Ooh, the 80s. Gotta love it. Gotta look, I got the cocaine part right. The girls in tight dresses always gave me fake numbers. Yeah. Oh, shit. Turn yeah. it up. You remember this? Come on. Dude, this was like, this was my high school, right? Early in the morning, uh, rising to the street. Light me up that cigarette and I strap shoes on my feet. What? You got to find a reason. A reason things went wrong. Got to find a reason why my money's all gone. Cause you stole it. I huh. got a Dalmatian. Got a Mason. And I can still get high. I still get high. I, I can, can play the guitar like a motherfucking riot. <laughs> That's the one. <laughs> Well, life is too fucking Come shit. on, man. Get into it. Come on, come on. Well, life is too short to love the way you jack. Cause you might get run over or you might get shot. Never start a panic, I just get it off my chest. Never had a battle with no bulletproof vest. Take a small example, take a tip from me and me. Take all your money, give it all to charity. And any love is what I got. It's within my reach. And Something very pissed off. This guy means business. You think? He flipped a fucking car! You know, steroids or something? I go with or something.
time to go. What the fuck is that thing? Something very pissed off. They got me stuck here. Down and back here. This guy means business. You think? He flipped the fucking car. You know, steroids or something? I go with or something. Time to tip on out of here. No doubt! Wasn't normal. Do you think? I've seen some scary motherfuckers, but the way he was shrugging off bullets? Something wasn't right. At least he's dead. Hear that? Daily Vodka! Thank you, Colin. 